well. So Richard, I'm going to start with you. Um, we have some images of you and the late, the great, uh, rest his soul, George Price. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, I know you took some images. There's one on the screen there that you can see. Um, you mm -hmm. had done a photo shoot with him prior to his passing, right? Why don't yes. you tell us a little bit about that? Well, that was for a project I was working on that I had to put in the back um, for the time being, which was called um, in the National Project. Very okay. simple um, title. The project was basically um, supposed to be uh, 30 Belizeans for the 30th anniversary of the independence. Um, 30 environmental portraits, so I'd actually go into the, uh, the person's realm instead of bringing them to the studio mm -hmm. and do a, um, a portrait of them then, uh, uh, there, you know, speak to them, get to know them, just kind of blend with them and, um, you know, really just kind of shoot a real portrait of them. Mm -hmm. So that, uh, and that's exactly what I did with Mr. Price. I, um, it took a long time to get his um, approval, but I, I managed to get to his home eventually with some help from some connections I had. And um, once I was there, you know, we, we spent a nice evening together and um, talked about all kinds of different things. And once he was relaxed is when I got him to do some of the best shots, the ones I published at least on Facebook. Okay. That's after we kind of spoke for like an hour, you know? Yeah. I mean, he knew me before that and everyone was him, so. Um, but that, that, he really opened up and I was quite surprised what he was, um, what he allowed me to do, you know? Yeah. To move around and things like that. So I think the, the portraits I did of him, uh, are um, very real and I've not seen anything like that before because everything I've seen of Mr. Price has been kind of like stately or a bit government oriented mm -hmm. and this is more like a, a real person, like a real... Yeah, and I saw on some he was playing the piano as well. Yes, yeah, because I love the piano, so I mean, I, I love that instrument myself. So just seeing that there, I asked him about it and I know he likes the national anthem. Mm -hmm. So he's very musically inclined, you know, he directs that. He did it a few times at uh, PUP conventions. He had people mm -hmm. start it over and say, you know, this is how you sing the anthem. Nice. And, um, oh. yeah. So I asked him to play it, and he did. So that will be, the show will be next year, September-ish? Yeah, well, if, I, I hope. Because okay. I have so many things going on right now, you know. Right, it's right, yeah. too many, so many things. A so lot of things, things happening. Exactly. <laughs> you know. Well, we'll get back to you in just a few. Now, 